I'ma leave early. Oh, we keep crash this in my dog while feed it to the intro. Hey guys, so this is what the scene is looking like. There is a pile up of vehicles on hold our road right now, right in front of Thetford Church. It is chaotic. I am not exaggerating. Look at the police. It's chaotic. War is popping. Look at that cute guy. Look at that cute guy. Like, he's, he has a very sexy walk. Anyway, that's not the point. That is not the point. We have hypo officials out right now because there is a hypo truck and I need to insert a video on me passing. I will show you what the truck looked like. But um, before I started videoing, it was a turned over feeding truck. It was prowled out across Hold Arbor Road. The traffic stretched for miles like Guys, it is not no like Yeah man, you're too out of there. You think you're better than nobody? Cause I walk in a week you know you think you're you think you think you're an idiot? Anyways, this is what the road looks like now. The firefighters are clearing the way. Oh my gosh guys. Woo! Freedom! Freedom guys, freedom! Look at that! The high pro truck is on the wrecker the high pro truck is on the wrecker look at that Guys, so okay for another follow me around. I wanted to show you guys the biggest mango I've ever seen. <laughs> Ready? This is a mango. What kind of mango is this? I mean, all right, she said she doesn't know the name of the mango, it's her mango, but this is the biggest. It looks like a Julie mango, just way bigger, but I don't know what it is. But look. For all the manga lovers out there, I guess you would definitely love this manga. I don't think I would even eat this manga. I would put it in a silicone and then glass casing. So, <laughs> who Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I feel like it's almost as big as her face. Um, the, wow. the Oreo ice cream and coffee on bottom, whipped cream, a cookie as a topper, almond shavings, and chocolate chip. It's amazing. Oh my gosh, what should I try? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. It tastes good. Hi guys. So, yesterday or day before, the mailman came. And he dropped off a little package. I want to say mailman, I mean an actual mailman. Like, I purchase stuff sometimes, especially only off AliExpress if it's a small item. I'd send it directly to my, my home address, right? So, the last time I've done that was before COVID. The last time I purchased anything off of AliExpress was before COVID. Legit, maybe December 2019 was the last time I purchased anything. And like I said, that was December 2019. This is... How am I saying? July. Call that, it came me around July 24th or something like that. July 24th, 22nd to the 24th. That's when it came in. I honestly do not remember what is in this package. Let me show you. 
I honestly do not remember what's in this package, so I decided to do an on an on packaging for my follow me around for my follow me around July, right? So here it is. Here it is, here it is, here it is. I'm gonna open it. And then I'm gonna video when this was made. As soon as we find out what it is, I'm gonna video when when I purchased this on AliExpress. If it's even still there, I'm gonna show you guys when I purchased it. I probably even got my money for it. Let's see. Okay. So this is something. This is something I purchased before I started YouTube. I started purchasing gifts. Um, these connection thingies like from maybe November October 2019 so this is it and some of you guys may be wondering what this is it's actually I have an iPhone and I use mics to video so if you guys know um, current iPhones do not have an iPhone jack an ear jack or anything for me to plug any mic in so I use this as a connection Wait here. So you just plug you just plug the, the mics in there and you're able to mic up properly. So this is what I used to bypass the old iPhone thing that they don't allow us to use stuff like that. So this is it. So in the next video you should see when I purchased that if it's there or if it's not there. This is me saying okay, it was so long ago it disappeared from my order list. I may, I, I may have deleted. I do not purchase anything off AliExpress anymore. I don't know why. Because I've gotten good purchases off AliExpress. And probably good, should start purchasing again. But I guess I don't need anything. Oh, I knew what it was. I knew what it was. I purchased a bunch of stuff. December 2019. A bunch of stuff. And almost none of them came. God bless. Maybe three out of the bunch came. So I just gave up. And I think it was due to COVID. So nothing was coming in, nothing, and I just stopped purchasing and I just forgot about it. So I'm guessing I'm actually going to any day I leave for work like late. I'm actually gonna stop by the post office and bring you guys along to show if I even get another package and maybe we we'll get another unboxing. This just was delivered to me because it's unregistered mail. Registered mails are not delivered to me. So you know what that means? It could be there for months and they're going to charge me storage fees. Okay. But I'll bring you guys along so I'm going to find out how long my registered mail has been there and if they'll be charging me because I got no, I didn't get a note and they're, so, they're such thieves. How can they prove that I got a note? If I didn't get a note, oh my goodness, there's something for collect there. I'm thief, but they're going to want to charge me for, for storage now if it that they love. So you guys are definitely gonna, I'm gonna bring you guys along for that. I'm supposed to be on a late shift in the coming two days. Yeah, I don't want to tell you that. So I'm gonna stop by the post office and I'm gonna bring you guys along to see what happened when I stop by if I have more mail there to collect. But in the meantime, see you on the flip side. <laughs>